Hi and welcome to episode one, uh, lockdown free. I'm calling this one because let's face it, we're all back in lockdown again. So uh, yeah, I'm just out for my daily walk, just been to the supermarket, get a couple of bits and pieces for dinner, a bit of lunch. And uh, yeah, lockdown free, here we go. So for those of you who don't know, this is Amy. She doesn't want to be in the video, but I'm making her be in the video today. Um, and she's she's got the ump with me because uh, last night I um, assisted her in tanning and for a laugh, I thought it would be a good idea to cake the uh, mitt in fake tan and then grab her hands. And she now has funky coloured hands. Do you, do you want to show everyone your hands? She said no. But basically her hands are a completely different colour to the rest of her body at the moment. And uh, yeah, she's not too impressed. But um, yeah, here we go. Anyway, so we're in lockdown free. Everyone's got the ump, haven't they? But um, I think it's the best thing. I was watching some news this morning and what's going on in hospitals is unbelievable we've never seen anything like it but uh yeah i'm just about to have a lorry come past me so i have to excuse the noise for a sec a couple of vans as well now hopefully you'll be able to hear me still but um yeah so uh, i find myself now in lockdown three not wanting to use my car at all. Um, popped the Tesco's last night, grabbed the motorbike, that was freezing and the panniers were frozen, so it took me a little while to get my shopping in the back. And I've just walked around the Sainsbury's now to get a couple of bits as well. It's almost like the daily excitement is going to the supermarket. Who thought that would be the case now? Well, I'm sorry about that. I had to cut the video short outside. There was so much traffic going past. It was uh, interfering with the microphone and you weren't able to hear every word I was saying. But um, as I was saying, I'm at home now, I'm in the flat. As I was saying, um, you know, going to the supermarket is is the excitement of the day. You know, trying to think of something to go for. You know, I went last night, got a couple of beers, bottle of coke. You know, night before, a couple of beers. You know, something else. Today it was going to get some bits for dinner, some bread for lunch. And you know, just trying to think of things to keep us occupied at this time and, and do things within the rules that we can. Now, I've not driven the car since uh, Monday evening. I don't think. Um, you know, there's been absolutely no need to. I'm quite happy walking or, or go out jumping on the motorbike. To, to wherever you know I need to, I need to go. I mean, I, went, I took the bike out last night. It was freezing. I won't be doing that again in a, in a hurry. Um, I've got the new one coming next week, so I'll update you on that uh, when it arrives on Tuesday. But um, yeah, it's just finding something to do, and, and I'm trying to do something different every single day. And if that means I walk somewhere different, or I you know, try looking at something different on, on the internet or something like that, you know, just trying to to keep my mind occupied and 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 you know not go crazy. And it's important that we do that because we don't know how long it's going to last. They've said six weeks. I can't see it being six weeks. I think it's going to be longer. I can't see us being out of this lockdown before March. But, you know, we'll see what happens. But on that subject, you know, we are all we are all struggling. We are all locked in. And, you know, it can be quite lonely for some people. And um, if you're sat there thinking that you want to, uh, you know, you wish you'd heard from a, a friend or a relative and you haven't heard from them for a while, they might be sat there thinking exactly the same thing about you. You know, why haven't you been in touch with them? And and you might be thinking, well, you know, it's not really my place to to get in touch with them. You know, why don't they get in touch with me? Well, do you know what? Pick up the phone, send them a text message, send them a WhatsApp. You know, give them a call, FaceTime, whatever. You know, everyone's struggling. Um, and and you know, receiving that message will make their day. And I guarantee you, you'll you'll get a response of some description. Um, and I'm sure it'll be a positive one. Like I say, it's just about you know, reaching out and letting people know you're thinking about them. I know it means the world to me when people share their thinking about me. You know, I, I received a message um, early December from a friend of mine in New Zealand, and it, it meant a lot to think that someone who was on the other side of the world, you know, was 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 thinking about me and 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 you know, he just took the time to to write me a message. And it wasn't even that long a message, you know, just asking how I was, you know, wishing me and my family well, you know, it was, it was just nice to receive. And, and I, I strongly recommend doing the same because it will really mean a lot to the person that you send it to. So Amy's trying something different. She's, she's learning to cook and she's just made oatmeal peanut butter cookies. But are they a, they're a, are they a, 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 a weight loss one? Okay, so these, the, the honey's full of sugar. I haven't got a clue what's going on, okay? I'm doing my best. <laughs> okay, okay. so you're not going to be able to eat them all in one sitting. Okay, so in 10 minutes, these things are coming out of the oven. Um, I'll show you what they're like. Wish me luck. Um, this is the first thing she's cooked since we've lived together. 
Okay, so Amy's just left the kitchen and she's just told me as she walked out that she can't remember what time she put these in. So we don't know what these are gonna look like, but um, I'm just having a little sneak peek in the other now. And she's actually done a pretty good job. They actually look, they look pretty good. I'm quite looking forward to these. Right, so Amy's just told me to sit down. The cookies are ready. So this is, like I said earlier on, this is the first thing she has cooked for me in the time we've been together. So, uh, so yeah, have you got it? <laughs> yeah. All right, so here we go. Right, so she's only given me half. So now I'm questioning why she's not giving me a whole one. But uh, it looks okay, you know. It's golden brown, but she's only given me a little bit. That's not burnt, that's the chocolate on the edge. So let's check it out. So these are chocolate chip, peanut butter, honey oat cookies. Pretty good. It's still right, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. That's fine. So I need to get her cooking again now. So I believe tomorrow night she's cooking me a Thai curry. I'm gonna try. Well, she says she's gonna try to, so I'm looking forward to that. But she has been to the shops three times to get the ingredients and still doesn't have all the ingredients. So we'll um we'll see how that goes. But um yeah, so we're all trying something new. So, you know, I'm trying to do different things. Amy's trying to do some cooking. I'm very grateful for it, actually. That's really nice. I look forward to our next thing. But um, but yeah, so you know, like I said today, everyone's in lockdown. It's all about embracing you know, what we can do to keep ourselves busy. My key message today, though, is if there's somebody that you want to hear from and you're feeling like you don't want to reach out to them, do reach out to them. Um, you know, they're probably feeling exactly the same way as you and it will make them feel so much better. It'll make you feel so much better, you know, just having that five minute conversation, an exchange of text messages or, or a FaceTime or WhatsApp video call, you know. It's all I can recommend really. It'll make you feel so much better, especially if you're feeling down because you're on your own or or you just you know haven't seen anybody for a little while. Um, somebody different, you know, it's good for you. But um, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, please share and uh, let me know what you think.